Hi! So, here's a tutorial to make the black eyeshadow with a gold sheen. The only recipe I remember to jot down. I'm sorry! All the ingredients are from TKB Trading, but this tutorial is no way sponsored, affiliated with, or approved by TKB Trading. As always, start with sterilizing everything. You should also wear gloves and a mask if you're making this for somebody else. Once you're done with all that, let's get the matte base ready. Mix the ingredients in the following ratio. I'm using more magnesium mirror state than usual because ferric ferrocyanide and black oxide are kinda gritty and I find that increasing the ratio of magnesium mirror state here helps them press better. Now, mix everything in a Ziploc bag and grind them together really, really hard. If you're making large quantities, use a magic bullet. It's way faster. Grab one portion of gold fine and mix it into the matte mixture. Mix it gently but well. Okay, I forgot to film one part, but I basically added TKB Trading's My Mix Clear Pressing Medium to the loose shadow until I get the texture of wet sand. This is another way I like to press my eyeshadows. Add alcohol and mix well until everything's dissolved. Keep packing in more eyeshadow until it's really packed. Wait for it to dry. Check if it still feels packed when it starts drying. You may need to pack in more eyeshadow and remix. Be patient with this. I've sped up the video by 30 times. This whole process actually took me about an hour. I have no life, so watching eyeshadow dry is the highlight of my Friday. Totally cool. Now, I'm putting tissue over the pan and lightly tapping it to make sure that the eyeshadow is packed enough. Now that I can lift the tissue cleanly off the pan, the eyeshadow is ready for pressing. You can press with just tissue, but I'm putting lace underneath the tissue so I can get a cool pattern. Press down hard with your palm and you're done! Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe and like. Let me know in the comments if there's a color you want me to come up with and I'll try to create a recipe for that. Thanks again and bye!